Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all having a great day so far. So I have finally done it. I have managed to get every single last doggo in Stormblood. All seven. We have Byakos, Tsukiyomi, Shinryu, Suzano, Lakshmi, Siryu, and Suzaku. Each one of these I have gone to hell to get, especially Suzaku, which is my very first doggo that I actually had to use 99 totems to get, while everyone else was basically through luck of the roll. Once you get all seven, the news hawker here and Kugane will be unlocked. This will allow you to get the fabled Kami Fife, which is basically the Nine Tails fate boss that you fight in Yansha. The news hawker is displaying a worrying decree of interest in you. Good day. This may seem rather out of the blue, but are you by any chance the Kami Whisperer? It does sound a bit like me. I don't know who you are and you're scaring me. <laughs> that does sound a bit like me. Perhaps it is you. You see, I've been asked to find the one who has tamed the seven Kami of legend. If the information I received is accurate, I believe my search has come to an end. Should I locate the Kami Whisperer, I am to direct said person to the Namai where a bard dressed in crimson robes awaits, aka the wandering minstrel. If you are indeed who I think you are, I am sure the trip will be worth your while. Alright, so I need to go to Namai. So when I get there, we will continue. Alright, so here is the wandering minstrel. It's actually right outside the Aetherite, so you can't miss him. And he's just staring out into the distance. I have been expecting you, Zane. My prediction that you would indeed be the one to gather the seven kami has, much to my delight, been proven correct. After all, tis not the first time you've managed to f a, fate, a feat of this nature. And boy, what a feat it was. You have formed an unbreakable bond with these mystical hounds, but what you may not know is there is another set to surpass them all. Majestic and fearsome to behold, do you have any inkling of whom I speak? Why, tis none other than of the Nine Tails, an auspice said to have one sword across the skies of Doma, many believe to be immortal, able to overcome death itself, yet doomed to witness all it has come to cherish, whether and fade from existence. Its howls echo through the valleys as a search searches for the one it considers to be its equal, that it may find a companion with, with whom to share eternity. While I cannot com comment on your longevity, I dare say you otherwise possess the necessary credentials to be granted an audience. All that remains is to play this fife to summon the beast. You, you need not concern yourself where I procured such an item, only that the Kami of the Nine Tails will heed its call should you be judged worthy. So what say you, my friend? Will you place your trust in me and embark on this quest to befriend a divine being? Naturally, I will be close at hand to observe as I have in the past. I could not possibly miss the opportunity to bask in such a glorious spectacle. Will you permit me to attend? Splendid. Unfortunately, I have already ascertained a suitable location not far from here, where the view of the one river should provide the perfect backdrop. Once you arrive, take the fight in hand and let your soul pour forth as melody. Try not to let the fact that a professional musician is paying close, uh, paying extremely close attention to your every note put you off. I am sure it will be an unforgettable performance.
Okay. So we need to go over yonder here. Above, yep. Destination Adventure Fife of Nine Tails. Oh, how I've waited for this day. You guys never will never know what, what my struggle was. And it's raining, of course. Oh, look at them all. Like the rainbow. Uh, how I was so jealous of people who rode this thing everywhere. Such radiance, such magnificence, the coming of the Nine Tails most revered of its kind is come. Its days of wandering alone across the realm have come to an end. Indeed, you have earned your place alongside this divine being, my friend. Ah, to witness the warrior of light joined by the coming of the Nine Tails and his brethren before my very eyes. Tis a moment that must be preserved in verse for future generations. Amen. Trail by tale, uh, tales of nine soaring across moonlight sky, restless traveler summoned home by hero's call, kindred soul adventurer. Yes, yes, I think I shall name this piece a lone wolf no more. It shall serve as testament to the friendship between two great beings favored by the gods. That you are able to earn the respect of such heavenly creatures fill, fills me with awe. You certainly seem to have a talent for it. May retelling of today's events is sure to encapture souls the world over, and perhaps they too will one day be fortunate enough to glimpse the two of you racing across the sky. Farewell, hero. A lone wolf no more. Complete. Flute of the Plume. This was utterly the last thing I needed to complete in Stormblood that I can do reasonably. And it plays. The music from Stormblood when you kind of like log into the game flies just like Fenrir. So instead of playing the regular Final Fantasy XIV music, it plays Storm the logging song from Stormblood. Ah, uh, look at this! Party finder at the party finder, fail group at the fail group, trap party after trap party. I have got them all. And this beautiful creature is mine. Now, in order, I got my Lakshmi dog first, then Biako, then it was Sukiyomi, which I won with the 24, and then it was Shinryu. No, it was um, Susano first, then uh, uh, Shinryu. Susano almost took me 99 kills. It was one of the hard. It was one of the most annoying ones of all to get because his drop rate sucked. 
Then it was the Shinryu, which it was, I think it was around 50 runs I, I had to get for that one. So Zaku, you know, I had to get 99 totems for this ding dong over here because for some reason I couldn't get this through the rolls, even though I, I got like an 80 and one of them and I still lost. And then the Siryu was my last one. I got it with a 94, which actually was a pretty good roll. Only took me about 80 something kills to get Siryu, but because Siryu was one of my favorite fights to do, it wasn't as taxing as the rest. So those were the orders of which I got these mounts. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this. Be Feel free to send all your congratulatory comments in the comment section down below. I will most likely welcome them with open arms. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new for more Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood content. Even though there is about almost less than a month left before the next expansion. And as a reminder, make sure you hit that notification bell next to my subscribe button. This way you guys will never miss an upload. And as always, make sure you follow me on all my social media. At Zane Lionheart on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So until next time, guys. May you ever walk in the glorious light of Lord Bahamut. Take care, guys. And hope that you get your doggos as well. Take care, guys.